good morning golf geeks gonna make this short and sweet first break 80 quest of 2024 today i'm over at danton uh, it's a winter tea start so i couldn't really get the camera behind me which is why you're over there um i'm playing well at the moment so i'm hoping today could be the day that i do it over danton on camera so first tee shot of the day i've not had a swing straight out of the car let's go Half four start. Bit down the left, but on the fairway. And uh, I'll take that. All right, golf geeks, I've got 176 to the centre. The flag looks at the front. I'm going to go with a five iron because I want to be up there, I don't want to be short. Comes through, set up properly, execute it properly. Great connection out of there. Oh, and I am short, just short of the right of the green. Just short of the front of the right. Connected with that, lovely. Thought that would have made it. As you can see, golf gigs, I'm a little short. And also, I've come at a good time, because they are, well, I'd say good time, not a good time really, because they're out cutting the course at the moment. But it's good for the course because the weather we've had lately, they're lucky they can get a tractor on here. So I've got to, uh, got to deal with some lumps of grass, but I'll take that to be able to be out here playing that the, the uh, green keepers are able to do their job because they've had a tough time with it. Watch your sound, I've got 21 yards here, guys. Golf Creeks, I've got my little ping chipper. Just gonna try and bump and run. Try and miss all this, miss the, the long, the, like the, the cut at the front of the green, land on the green and run up. Or hit the flag and go in. Come on. Happy days. Break 80 quest starts with a birdie, golf geek. Starts with a birdie. <laughs> Starts with a birdie golf creek. It's never happened, that. Get in. We'll take that all day long. So, golf geeks, what a start that was. A chipping birdie on the first. Great start. Long par five, straight up. Right up to that pylon. That's a great start. Let's try and keep that going, eh, golf geeks? How good would that be if I can keep that going? Hey, how good would that be if I can keep that going? Let's try and wait for this greensman. I hope he's watching. I can't get the tee in the ground that, that well, so I might have to go down the shaft a little bit. Might have to hover the, hover the club. Left again, left side of the fairway again, I'll take it. That was not a good shot that though, not a good shot. Got me new five wood that I put in the bag. Should leave, should get me up there. If I eat it white days, leave me about 80 yards in, if not less. Just want to get a good connection. Jesus. Wow, that's wet there. 
That was more like a five wedge than a five wood. Blimey, it was a bit too close there. In the wind, golf geeks. I'm gonna go over nine iron. In the wind, I don't think I'll get there with a wedge. left of the flag it's too long yeah a bit long maybe I should have gone with a wedge just on a back lip of the green don't know if you can hear me golf geeks with that tractor but like you see fourth shot here I've got a 56 degree I want to try and land it soft so it doesn't roll through we will have it do what I did on the last hole, wouldn't it? Chip in. Ah, oh. Duffer Rooney, Duffer Rooney. I knew I should have gone with my chipper. Oh, I left myself a long par putt now. I mean, I will say, considering the weather and how known these greens are for not being the greatest they're in pretty good condition for the for, for Dunton anyway so I'm not gonna moan about them tough par part here not an easy par part what a par part when it went there two to five wedge three four yeah par part and I'll tell you what, golf geeks, it's warm, warmer today than I expected it to be. Come on, come on. Oh. Unlucky. Bogey. Birdie bogey. All the bees. Another winter tea, golf geeks doing the best I can to get a good angle. I'm going with a different approach today for the uh, for the camera golf geeks. Normally I have a tripod. Today I've just connected it to my trolley. It does get a bit difficult doing it on your own, so I'm trying a new, new angle. Please, please like, please subscribe. Get on board with the channel. I'm trying my best here. I hope you're all enjoying it, but just let, get in the comments, let me know what you think of the, uh, of the angle of the camera, if it looks any different. I mean, I can't afford to get something to be my cameraman, so I've got to do it all on my own. So I'm level par after two, dog leg right par four. I've got a free hybrid in my hand, just want to get down to the corner. Off the mat. And I'm, oh, might have to go again, golf geeks, because I've put that one right on the corner. Everything's been going left. This one goes right. A reload, just in case I don't find the other one. And that is a much better shot, longer as well, probably past the corner. Should have done it with my first one. Let's hope I find the first one, Golf Geeks. Unfortunately, Golf Geeks, I did manage to find it, but it was unplayable. So I'm gonna take my, my provisional one that I played. So, fourth shot here. One in there, drop one, two, three off the tee, hitting four. I could have played three from there, but I'm gonna be no, no better option. And I, I could see it, but I couldn't get it. So, yes, yeah, well in that bush, but. Another nine iron again, 109 yards. Same as the last hole. Hopefully this one will be on the greener. Now 
No, that's fat and short. Blimey, today's. It's difficult golf. It's difficult golf. I mean, the grass is quite long on the fairway, but I'm not expecting to be taking divots like that. The trusty chipper, guys. The trusty chipper. Ooh, ooh. So, one into there. Drop one, two. Three, four, five. I've got this for a six. Double bogeys. On a break 80 quest. What do we say, golf geeks? You can't get double bogeys if you want to break 80. It just means I've got to get some birdies. I've got to get this in first. Four or six. To save a double bogey. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh, seven golf geeks, seven. Work's cut out now. Right, forget that, seven. Next hole, par three, blind shot, dead straight down. He's saying I've got 150, but I'm going with a six iron. Normally a seven, but I'm going with a six. a bigger way to come up there, golf geek, so I'm even more out of breath now. It's a bit left, but hopefully left of the, left of the green. I might know until you get there. So I don't know if you'll be able to hear me back there, golf geeks, but I'm right over the back here. Six one was way too much. Far too much. So I've got a very tough chip back and over to a middle, middle of the pin flag. Get up, get up, get up, get up. I'll take that. Let's give me a chance for par. Let's give me a par putt. That's what I've got to start getting. Good up and down par there. Good up and down par there. I would normally go driver because the tees will be back over there, but I'm going to go free wood. I haven't been using this free wood much. Been down the range trying to get it working, so let's have a go. Aim at that pylon and let my fade bring it around the corner. And it's a great shot, golf geeks. But I think it might be too long. Because there's water just up there. I was hoping my fade would come round over that tree and it stayed straight, but lovely shot with that free wood. Happy with that. I'm not gonna complain with that free wood. I've got 77 yards. I've got a 50 degree. I'll tell you what, golf geeks, I'm sweating. It's well warm. I'm not, well, I shouldn't be moaning, I'm not moaning at all. Just surprised how warm it is. Come on, concentrate on the shot now. Get it on the green, close, birdie putt.
come on, be close. I'll take it. Again, it's a bit left. I'm pulling everything left today. It's not left me an easy part. Come on, make these count. Make these count. Again, golf geeks, what do I always do? You've got to hit it. You've got to hit it. <laughs> take the flag out. I'll take a par, but come on. So, golf geeks. So golf geeks, while I'm waiting for the, the guy in front of me to play his shots, I'd like to say please like, please subscribe, please jump on board my little golf geek nation that I'm trying to get going on YouTube and Instagram and you know Twitter and all that, all them, all them places. Please follow me. I'm trying my best just to uh, have a bit of fun with it. It's a hobby of mine. But it would be nice to get some of you to come along on the ride with me. Um, I'd like to thank the people that are already subscribed. I, I really appreciate your support, it does mean a lot. Um, all the people that have sent me comments, good and bad, I like them all because that's what it's all about. You shouldn't do this if you can't take the good and the bad. So yeah, I love it all, people, or my golf geeks that are out there. So please, please carry on supporting the channel. I'll try and do as best as I can. And I'll try and bring you some content that you enjoy. So let's, uh, let's crack on. Three over after four due to that seven, which is not good. But another par four. I'm hoping that he's out of range. He does look it. Over the top of this man with a bit of a fade, and then should just give me about 100 yards in, par four. Yep, yeah, over the man, bit of fade. On the fairway. Gotta love golf. When you call the shot and you execute it. Got to love it, got to. Wind a bit right to left. So, take that into consideration. I mean, it's bang at it, but I don't think it's long enough. Oh, no, that's all right. Take that. We will take that, come on. We will definitely take that approach, golf geeks. I'm taking the flag out for this one. Birdie opportunity. Birdie opportunity, I have to make these count. Come on, lovely old that great drive, great 50 degree, nice putt, birdie, come on. It's a tough green to get onto this one, so I need to get on it. Come on, concentrate, execute, and enjoy it. And I've pushed it right. 
Well pushed it right. That's going to give me one hell of a tough shot back. Jesus Christ, that's terrible. Where'd that come from? Where did that come from? All right, golf geeks. Very, very tough shot I've got here. Golf geeks, very, very tough shot I've got here. And so Dan Hill from where it's coming towards me, green. There's a bunker here, very big, deep bunker. And I'm right back over here. Very, very tough shot I've got here, golf geeks. Very tough. I am here, I've got a 50 degree in my hand because I want to get it up and over the bunker. But I ain't got much green to work with. I've got an horrible stance. Now this is what, this is what separates the men from the boys, these sort of shots. A nip bee, not quite in the bunker yet, I call it. Come on. Sit, sit, sit. It's behind Jews, guys. Only just behind Jews, but I'll take that from where I was. I was so scared of that bunker. I've got another tough shot here, golf geeks, because this all runs down that way. So you were just at the back here, and it all runs down that way. So I've got to really try and land it here as soft as possible and see if it rolls down. I do like this little club. I do recommend it to any mid to high handicapper. Oh, went for it. Look at it go, look at it go, look at it go, look at it go, look. Shouldn't have gone for that, should I? It's because I like this club. I think I can chip in every time I have it in my hands, but there, oh, it's too quick. Letting myself down here. Bad five. Mental though, isn't it? Every time I've got a birdie, I didn't go and back it up with a double bogey or a treble bogey. Can't do that, can ya? Can't do it. Just need to get them holes out my head. Par five, eighth. Let's start with a drive. I just want to lay up about 200, 220. I've got 250, 260. I've got actually, so I just want to really want to lay up middle of the fairway, just give myself a chance of a par, if not a birdie. Try and get some shots back on this break 80 quest. And that looks perfect. It's nowhere near, but it's just at the front to the left of the green. Well happy with that. Great shot from there. Gives me a chance. Right, golf geeks, got 56 yards left. And I'm going with a 56 wedge. Land it soft. On for three, two putt for a par. Or land it close, one putt for a birdie. Come on. I mean, that looks good. Go on, roll, 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 roll. Yeah. Happy with that, golf geeks, happy with that. I don't spin a ball, so bump and run was all right. Straight putt. Commit to it. 
for a change. Commit to it, don't accept the par, try for the birdie. Come on, oh, unlucky. <sighs> At least it was not short golf geeks, that's the main thing. It wasn't short. Ah, happy days, happy days. And that's the, that's what happens. I mean, that ain't bad. But it's a long way into the green. Oh dear, top of Rooney. Top of Rooney. I've still got 250 odd yards from here, golf geek, so just gonna try and get a, a four hybrid out and up to the front of the front of the green and try and get up and down. I mean, I got under it. It's definitely up there, but still a bit of a bit of a distance. But now I'll take that. 82 yards, golf geeks. I'm going to just go a soft wedge because I want to be close to try and save me par. Christ, what did that hit? Literally hit off a sprinkler at a sink, bounced up. All right, I've got this for a par. It would be nice to start with a chip in and end with a chip in would be nice. Just like a putting stroke. Just like a putting stroke. Go on, go on. Ah. Oh. That is unlucky. That is unlucky. But I'll take a bogey. 41 that was for that nine. 41. Four over. Still on, Golf Geek, still on. Plenty to play for, still on. So, I've got to score well on the back nine to break 80 geeks. Oh, for Christ's sake. Can't get the tee in the ground. It's just concrete. Again, driver's out of the question. Three wood. Very tough. And if this carries on the way around, the break 80 quest is definitely going to be hard because I've got to go around the back 938. Jeez, didn't think of that. Right, par four, little dog leg left. Just get one in between the two bushes would be lovely. Just want to play a shot over the top and give myself a chance. Oh, it's so bad. So bad. That's a five wood. All right, golf geeks, I need to concentrate now if I want to break 80. So I'm going to play golf. No talking, play golf, and let's try and break 80. Cue the music. <laughs>
right golf geeks first break 80 quest of 2024 I have three holes to play and to get a 79 I need at least one birdie in the last three holes can't have any bogeys if I par them all it's bang on 80 if I birdie one of them it gives me a 79 so it's as I always do making it hard for myself but it's still on it is still on get behind me golf geeks come on can we do it first time breaking 80 on camera is it doable is there a birdie in me in the last three holes I've got a par four par three par five so very very possible golf geeks but again it is difficult here I am on the 16th it's hot today you know I tell you hot one today but I've enjoyed it break 80 quest still on let's have it Come on wind, come on wind. Wind never caught it. Just waiting for that tractor to go past golf geeks, but it's still on. I need one birdie in these last two holes. One birdie gets me a 79. Par three, par five. This is 165 to the centre. I've got a five iron into the wind off the mat, so it's not easy, but it is doable. Come on, golf geeks, get behind me. Oh, that's right at it. That's right at it. Be good, be good. Well, it's on. We are on. Two putts or one putt birdie. This one here, golf geeks. This is the first shot I hit, but I hadn't turned the camera on. So this was my birdie putt, but I didn't have the camera on. So because I want to do it, properly so you see every shot I hit on the camera I'm going with that one because that's the one I got to record but how unlucky is that so now I've got a birdie putt from here but I'm not taking that one because I didn't record it I could have just walked up and told you but you wouldn't believe me so I've gone with the one that I've recorded long birdie putt I'd be more than happy to walk off here with a par and then try and birdie the par five last in all honesty. So I'll dust, get inside a dustbin lid, take the par and walk away. Ooh. Ooh, 
deer. I'd have liked to have been a bit nearer than that. Would have liked to have been a bit nearer than this for par. But I'll take it, I have to birdie the last. To break 80, I need a four on the par five last. And it's wind with, it's wind behind. So there's a chance, there is a chance. Come on golf, let's do this. So golf geeks, if you're still here, thank you for still being with me. I am on 75. No, yes, yeah, 75. So I need a birdie on this par five 18th for a 79 and to break 80 for the first time on camera. I mean, I've had two birdies today, but I've also had a seven and a couple of double bogeys. So this is gonna take two big hits because I really need to get on the green for at least two if I can to try and get a birdie. Come on golf geeks, once again, please like, please subscribe, please push me and follow me to try and break this 80 if I don't do it today, but I've got a funny feeling. I've really got a funny feeling. But please, thank you for your support, I really appreciate it. Anyone that wants a round of golf, get in contact, we'll try and sort something out. I'm open to play with anyone and let's just enjoy the round of golf that we have. So keep following me, keep liking, keep subscribing. Let's do this for you, golf geeks. Come on, let's do this. Nice big drive to end. Give me a chance, eh? Come back, come back. Yes, that's it, that's the one. Left side of the fairway, but it's away from the water, which is what I want. Come on, golf geeks, part one done. Part one done. 2.30 left with the wind. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. The wind is howling. God's looking down, let's go for it. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, get up, get up. Oh. <laughs> I've just cleared the water. Just, just cleared the water. Golf geeks, I'm walking up the 18th. I've cleared the water, only just. You will see in a minute, but I've got three shots from where I am for an 80, or two for a 79. It's on, it's under my control. So a close chip on, or chip in, would be brilliant and a birdie putt. So it's down to me now. Get behind me golf geeks. You'll see how close I am to the water when I come round the corner here. If you can just, I don't know if you can just see it over the water's edge there. If you can just see it, just there. It is just, just there or there. But yeah, so I just cleared it. Just cleared it. And I've got a long chip, so I don't know whether to bump and run it or try and flick a 50 degree up at it. But let's go, let's do this. So you can see where I am, golf geeks. I've decided to go with my trusty chipper. If you've watched this video, you see what I did on the first hole. Let's pray that I'll do it on this one. I need it close.
keep rolling, keep rolling, keep rolling, keep rolling. It's giving me a chance. I have that for a 79, birdie putt 79, come on. I'm actually nervous. Golf geeks, I am actually nervous. I really want this. I want to be able to move on to something else. Maybe you can give me some suggestions. But I've got this for a 79. First time on camera, can I break 80? times have I done it over here? How many times have I played this course? Oh. Golf geeks. With a seven on my card there, I didn't think I was going to do that. I've got two birdies today. I've got three birdies with that one. Oh. Happy days. Thank you again for watching, golf geeks. I hope you enjoyed that. I've finally done it. I finally broke 80 at Dunton. Right. Get in the comments. Give me another course you want me to try and do it at. And start another break 80 course at another course. Dunton, you are done. I've done it. Come on. Yes.